Alrighty, everyone, welcome to the break. Uh, this is for, what is this for? F- uh, ten, uh, 10 hangers, um, 5 optic, and 5 prism. This is the last of the optic hangers I have. Um, I honestly don't have much optic. If you've broke with me before, you know. Um, I said it. I don't. I, ne- I didn't get a whole lot of optic this year. Um, so this is the last of the optic hangers I had. This is the second exact break that I've done of this. I did the same exact one last week. Um, that one I did ten hangers too. Honestly, nothing too great. Uh, last week I also did a whole case of optic blast. Excuse me, blasters. Um, we got a downtown of Brian Dawkins, I think, uh, in the case of blasters. But uh, for as far as hangers went, we didn't get any downtowns. Um, cards were decent, nothing too spectacular. So um, we'll see if we get anything good in this break. Um, just letting you know, last last week, uh, no downtowns out of the hangers. And I think you can get downtowns out of hangers. So there's a decent chance that... Someone could be walking away with the downtown. <clears throat> so, anyways, um, I've this is the last of the optic hangers I have. I've I will be doing another break with, op, with the last optic blasters I have. It, I have eight optic blasters, and then I'll be doing two prism blasters with that break. Um, and then, let's see what else. And then, <clears throat> I've got just a bunch of optic packs. Um, I think you could still get downtowns out of those packs, if I'm not mistaken. If I am mistaken, someone correct me. Let me know. But anyways, um, to get started with the break, I will put the team names here. So here's the team names for the break. Um, I have what the teams sell for because it, those, that have, those that are new with me, I think just about everyone, and most of my breaks are new with me except Chris. He always breaks with me chris is uh has been with me since day one but uh a few of you have broke with me before also but a lot of you are, are new so i have what the team sell for here um i make sure that i'm not losing any money on the break because as you can see i got these all from walmart these are all literally walmart that's why they have 20 cards and not 10 um if you didn't believe me the barcode is walmart barcodes and same thing with these optic hangers so these all came from walmart <laughs> $22 plus tax, so about 230 to 240 worth of product that I'm breaking alone. Plus, I spend, I buy all products brand new. Um, I spend hundreds and hundreds of dollars worth of supplies, um, card supplies, shipping supplies, bubble mailers, everything. So, every break, I'm spending a good $30, $40 worth of supplies. As long as I'm not losing any money, that's all I really care about. Um, if I do lose money, though, I will cancel the break. I've only had to do it a few times. Um, each time, I would have lost like $200. And just doing breaks takes me about five hours on average to do the breaks. It takes me a half an hour alone to do the listings. It takes me, depending on the size of the break, I mean, this one's not too big, but this one might take me closer to four hours um, because it's not a big break. It's only 200 cards. Um, but I, I I mean, when I do my case breaks of optic and prism, that could take a, a long time. So I spend a lot of time doing breaks. Um, and if I lost money on my breaks too, um, I would uh, be going bankrupt. And I, w- I will... Uh, in, here in a few minutes, I'll tell you guys what I do for a living. I'm, I'm not a millionaire, so I can't be losing money. Otherwise, I'd go bankrupt. <laughs> um, so this all started off as a hobby for me. I My first break ever was, I think, 10 score packs, and I made 50 bucks off of that. I used that profit to buy more products and more supplies, and then it just went on from there. So um, I do a lot of breaks. Uh, as long as I don't lose any money, though, that's all I care about. I've done a lot of breaks, so where I've basically broken even, and that's fine by me, um, just as long as it's not in the negative. Um, so these are the team names. Uh, <clears throat> also, I'm not making 357. eBay takes out 13% of this, just so you know. Um, rules of the break are pretty simple. 
Cards will go to whatever team is on the card. Um, all hits will get sleeved, top loaded. All, I sleeve all rookies. I top load all rookie parallels. Top load all hits. Um, I sleeve all parallels. So if it's just a base parallel, I just sleeve it. So, um, so yeah. Um, I like to also tell you a little bit about about me um, before I get started. Uh, in case you decide to stay in my Facebook group or just if you want to add me as a friend. Um, I've helped a lot of people in my break with other things besides breaking because it's a small world and we all are learning off of each other. So um, I am 23 years old. I uh, grew up in Green Bay, so I'm a diehard Packer fan. I was actually named after Brett Favre. Um, I grew up in Green Bay, Wisconsin. Right now I'm living in Madison, Wisconsin, which is about two, two and a half hours away from Green Bay. I graduated a year ago, at, and I am a PE and health teacher. So I'm a teacher, first-year teacher. We don't make a lot of money. Um, that's what I was getting at with the whole I'll go bankrupt thing. We don't make a ton of money. Um, so, uh... Alrighty, um... Well all right, um, I hope that it's good now. Uh, I'm having issues with my phone. It's um, dying, and my charger's not really working, so I might have to upgrade and get a new one. Um, ho hopefully, it's I'm literally on 1%, but I, I have it set up right now where my phone is fine, so I, I'm going to... I've never broke this way before. Maybe I have once or twice, but I'm going to be up and down now. Um... That's what happened. My phone is dying, so if I cut out, I, I, I'm gonna, my intro, I'm gonna, it usually takes about ten, five to ten minutes, so hopefully if for the next five or ten minutes it doesn't cut out, and then we'll be set for the rest of the break. Um, but, never happened before. My phone is having a lot of issues right now. Um, anyways. So I will be keeping it like this. I'm not going to move my phone because when I move my phone, it's, I think it's more my charger that's broke than um, it stops charging. So where I was at, um, I graduated a year ago. I am a PE and health teacher at a middle school. Uh, I love what I do. Absolutely love it. It's super fun. Um, but... uh <clears throat> and I am from Green Bay, and but if there's any money I make, right? So in the short run, if there's any money I make, it goes to buying more products. I will literally spend hundreds, thousands. I think the most I've ever spent was like three thousand dollars worth of product. And it's when Prism came out. They didn't. My Walmart hadn't stocked Prism for what was it like two months, and then they stocked Prism, and I bought a bunch of Prism. It wasn't just one Walmart. It was a bunch of Walmarts, actually. Um, it's when they were switching vendors. So uh, most I ever spent in a day was 3000 But I spent thousands of dollars a day um, buying product sometimes or hundreds. Uh, buying product, buying supplies. Uh, the other day I spent $30 on team bags alone. So I spent a bunch of money on supplies. Um, in the short run, it goes back to that, uh, sort of like what I was saying with my first break ever. It was just some score packs and then went out from there. But then in the long run, if there's truly any money I make, it's greatly appreciated. Um, what it goes to is I am 23 years old, as I said, and I'm probably the youngest Packers season ticket holder. So my grandpa, he got season tickets about four years ago, and he didn't want them anymore so he asked me if i wanted them and i said heck yeah so he transferred them into my name um my aunt also wanted them so he transferred two of them into my name two of them into my aunt's name so i am a packer season ticket holder um every year i pay 1600 dollars for two seats so 800 dollars a seat it's a lot of money but um for the licensing fee just put them into your name it is 2100 dollars per seat um, so that, that's where all my fun money is going to, is my grandpa. Um, you get that money back if you ever get rid of them, which I never will. So I look at it as a cost that I had to pay for the tickets. And I would have had to anyways, because I'm already on the waiting list. I'm still on the waiting list, actually. They never took me off. Um, 
I wouldn't get them until I'm about 70 at least, so um, I, I'm just blessed to have them. It is very pricey though. I paid my grandpa half that, so I paid him $2,100 <coughs> uh, this year, and next year I'll be paying him the rest. So anyways, that's a little bit about me. I'm a huge Packer fan. Love football. I know we suck this year. You don't have to tell me. So anyways, um, once again, this is the last Optic Hangers I have, so hope it's good. Um, I do have, I'm trying to think, I've got probably 80 more hang, uh, Prism Hangers. I've got, I think, 20 Prism Megas and just a bunch of Prism Blasters still in Prism Packs. So I've got a lot of Prism. I've got only eight optic uh, blasters and optic packs after this. Um, or I have a lot of optic packs actually. I think I have 30 optic packs, but only eight optic blasters after this. Um, so yeah, and select, I only have eight select blasters left, but I do have a lot of select packs also. So I've got a lot of good product left. Um, but as far as optic hangers go, this is it. So I hope it's good. At least for now, this is it. Kyle Rudolph. And these are actually the first... Uh, the last break I did was the first prism hangers I opened. So this is the second round of prism hangers I'm opening. Patrick Queen. Uh, Jordan Lewis. Traquan Smith. James Harrison. Curtis Martin. Russell Wilson, Randall Cobb. Typically, when I open up Prism, though, for this year, it is so bad quality, such bad quality. But this, I think that these hangers that I've been opening have been pretty good, so I'm glad to see it. Quinn and Williams, Larry Johnson, Thurman Thomas, Derek Carr. Canarius Tony is the rookie, so he will get sleeved. Robbie Anderson. He'll get sleeved. Uh, Silver, Diami Brown. He'll get top loaded. LaVisca Chenault, Red Ice. Darnell Mooney, Red Ice. Jerome Bettis, Red Ice. Sam Ellinger. And Devonta Smith. Fireworks. Um, like what I said, all rookie parallels will, will get top loaded. Um, what is it, though? I, I heard Sam Ellinger, though, is... Uh, <clears throat> he's um what's what's been going on with Sam someone said make sure you sell all your Sam cards I think he got injured or something I don't know I picked him up for my fantasy team for like one or two weeks and he was a bust so <laughs> maybe some other team could scoop him up and he'll be uh better but in those cases, it's interesting because obviously the rookie card, you want the rookie card, but the rookie card, they're on a different team. So like Brett Favre, you know, Brett Favre, one of the Packers, greatest legends. If you want his rookie card, you got to get his, uh, what is it, Atlanta Falcons, right? Not even the Packers card. All right, next hanger. <clears throat> Brandon Ayuk. CJ Henderson, AJ Green, Kevin Byard, Cooper Cup, Derwin James Jr., Rich Gannon, Devin Singletary, Derwin James Jr. again, really? That's literally the same card in the same hanger. I don't think I've ever seen that before. And there's nothing different about the two. Brock Lenz, Lesnar, Zeke Elliott, Mike Alstott, Trey Nixon going to the Patriots, Brian Burns, Felipe Franks. So we're getting some QB rookie parallels, but not the top ones. Jordan Brooks. 
Sean Taylor, Deion Jones, Kylan Hill going to my Packers, and Tua. Yeah, Packers didn't sell for this break. Um, I was thinking about keeping the Packers. Sometimes I do keep the Packers. Sometimes I don't even list the Packers. Uh, for this one, I was actually thinking about keeping the Packers, and I was thinking about it a lot. Typically, Packers, they never get any hits. But any rookie parallel you get, literally anyone, doesn't matter who the player is, it's a win in my books because they're so limited, so rare. Like, a lot of these, you only get one rookie parallel per box or two. Like, you can see right here, we, we only have four right now. So that's basically where all the value is at. Anyways, where I was getting with that is if I would have taken the Packers for this break and that's the only Packer card we got, I would have been happy with that. Baker Mayfield, Eater Gross Matos, Deontay Johnson, Cameron Jordan, Leonard Williams, Deshaun Watson, Curtis Martin, Russell Wilson, Randall Cobb, it's going to Houston, Quinn and Williams. I actually am friends with Randall Cobb's mom on Facebook. Don't ask how it happened. <laughs> but, well, I, I could tell you how it happened. Barry Sanders, Adrian Amos, Kenneth Gainwell, Michael Brockers, Justin Field Silver. Oh my gosh. Probably, uh, yesterday we had a pretty decent Justin Fields hit, but this is for sure the best Fields hit we've had in a while in my breaks. I had, um, a Trevor Lawrence, Silver, I had two Trevor Lawrence lasers. I think I had Trevor Lawrence disco. I had a few Trevor Lawrence patch cards. I had Trey Lance disco. I had, I think, a Mac Jones good card. But this is the first Justin Fields hit in a very long time, or maybe it's the second. Because yesterday we had we had one. Ross Blacklock. Yesterday's so though wasn't that good. This one is way better. Joey Boza, Tony Brown. This is Avon Collins, an emergence, Javante Williams. So I'm glad to see that. At first, when I started doing breaks with this uh, year's product, or these rookies, um, I got fields right and left, and then fields, I barely got fields. So good for Chicago. Probably at least made your money back right here. I think that these cars are selling for 80 Actually, this, this one might be more because I don't think that this is that's, um, the normal fields. I think that this one is the better or like the more limited fields. I'm going to look it up real quick. Justin Fields Silver Prism. Um, yeah, well, the other one, 102, 102 bucks for the other one. Let's see about it. Let's see this one. I don't know why there's two variations. Oh, th that one's 60, I'm seeing. So this one actually is worth half, but still, whoever has Chicago, let's see what, what you paid. Paid 37, so you made your money back. Whatever, whatever you get here from now on, you're in the plus which is actually shocking because Chicago hasn't sold Chicago hasn't sold for that much in quite a while so I'm glad that uh, Chicago got a hit there oh I was like why is this not open um, I didn't get the entire plastic off there we go Two more prison hangers. An optic. I'm feeling we I'm feeling we have a downtown because like what I said last break, didn't get any downtowns and I think that these all came from the same case. 
Uh, cut those out on camera. I knocked some stuff out of the garbage. Byron Jones, Jimmy Garoppolo, Avon Kears, <clears throat> Robert Woods, DeForest Buckner, Josh Allen, Kenneth Murray, Randy Moss, Travis Kelsey, Rashad Perriman, Calvin Ridley, Marquez Colson, Jamar Jefferson, Joe Mixon, oof. Thought that was going to be a Jamar. Trey Lance Silver, look at that, wow. How much did San Fran, I think San Fran, oh, 22.5. Not bad. San Fran also making your money back. Aaron Donald. TJ Hawkinson. Blake Jarwin. Cornell Powell. And Jonathan Taylor. See, I have so many hangers. And what they say is hangers have the bangers. But I have so many hangers that I'm just worried that, you know. Not all of them are going to have the bangers. Not even close. It's not possible. But <clears throat> what I will say, though, is um, every single... It was like for the first 10 Prism Blasters I opened, just about every single one had it. cards like that. Like a really big name. Silver or Laser or Disco. It was literally the first 10. So we'll see what we get in this one. I have so many more prison hangers. I don't want to get them all out at once, all the good ones out at once, but who knows? Maybe they just stack all the hangers with the good ones. Van, Van Jefferson, JT, Isaiah Simmons, Zach Cunningham, Nelson Aguilar, Justin Jefferson, Kenny Drake, Cole Beasley, Austin Eckler, Sam Darnold, Denzel Ward, Hayden Hurst, Pete Warner, Jalen Waddle going to Miami, Elijah Moore, Jets, Denzel Mims, Roland Sutton, Derek Brown, ooh, Travis Etienne, and Josh Allen. I was going to say, if this was uh, Trevor, or if that was a Zach Wilson, that'd be quite a start to the break. If this was a Zach Wilson, that'd just be sweet, because this is a, a color match. I mean, regardless, this is sweet, because it's a color match, but if it was Zach Wilson, it'd be even sweeter. With that color match green. Alright, here we go. If I see any light of a downtown, I am saving it for last, just so you know. Because you can get downtowns out of these, I think. Yeah, you can get downtowns out of these. So if I see any downtown, I am saving it for last. I don't know if we will get one or not. Or at least I'll try to save it for last. That's what I like to do. I like to save the hits for last. Optic is my favorite though. If you don't if you didn't know that about me, that's something about me. I love Optic. It is my favorite. It always has been and it always will be. I don't care that there's no autos in here. I love Optic. Devin McCordy. Marcus Lawrence. Steve McMichael. Larry Johnson. Justin Jefferson. OBJ, Tyler Lockett, Matt Ryan, Forrest Buckner, Joe Burrow, we got Kadarius Tony, making two different piles, sleeve piles. 
So that's what I'm doing here. All right, there we go. Richie Grant, Keen Nwangu, Debo Samuel, Kyle Trask, Heaven Holland, Chubba Hubbard, Jalen Waddle, Gridiron Kings, Josh Palmer, and Ian Book. So we are getting a lot of QBs here. gonna run out of top loaders here so now I'm gonna have to get some more well I have more but I'm gonna have to get up and get some more I think if I recall right from last break um, don't know if we got any big name or any big name of these blues either. So just so you know. Could be looking at a big name blue, whatever these are. Blue scope, I think these are. But if you look at it, we got one, two, three, four, this Kyle Trask, and five, five uh, QBs already. Now we're waiting on Matt Jones, Trevor Lawrence. Um, is that it? Matt Jones and Trevor Lawrence? No, Zach Wilson too. If we get every, if we get at least one card of each of those guys, that'll be a, a victory in my in my eyes. Actually, I'm going to set that there since we have Kyle Trask. I'll switch him out. Garbage is overflowing. Oh my gosh. All right, Corey Davis, Jerry Judy, Stefan Diggs. Jalen Hurts, Damian Will uh, Harris, Carson Wentz, Marcus Davenport, Vince Young, Cooper Cup. Oh, I thought that, that was gonna be a downtime. Um, Jarvis Landry, Ian Book, top load him since he's a QB. Eric Stokes, Kyle Trask again. T Higgins, Silver. Alan Wallace, Blue Scope, Ronnie Perkins, Blue Scope, Cornell Powell, Blue Scope, Najee, Alan Kamara, and Jalen Waddle. Wow. I forget what these parallels are called, these ones in the back, but they are special. I think last break we had something like this happen where we had. I think like two or three of the inserts, like we had a Ian Book insert and then a Kyle Trask insert. And then the next hanger I opened, the, the base cards were in them. Alright, three more after Kangas to go. I'm gonna go grab some more top loaders. Three more after hangers to go. Got some more top loaders. We are all set.
Yeah, I think these all came from the same case. And, um, downtowns, as we know, are case hits, so I don't know how many come in a case of hangers, but gotta be getting one out as soon. It's like not in this hanger, at least. Robert Tunning, Justin Herbert, Chase Young, Dan Marino, Michael Gallup. Michael Thomas, AJ Brown, Kyler Murray, Joe Mixon, Sam Darnold, Micah Parsons, Trey Lance, there you go, Mari Rogers, he's a uh, Houston Texan now, Chris Evans, gosh darn it, Chris Evans, there's my cat, he was uh, chilling for the first part of the break, for the first time ever. But ever since I got him, he always gets in all my breaks. Carlos Boogie Basham, Tennessee, Elijah Molden, Baltimore, Odefe Owa, Jamar Chase, top one in. Legendary logos, Baker Mayfield, and Quiddy Pay. This one was not too shabby, not the best, so. So top of that Jamar. Still have to get a really big name blue scope, shockingly. I mean you only you get three three rookie or three of them per hanger. I don't know, that Kyle Trask is not really a, I'm not counting that as a big name, although that is a QB. All right, two more. No downtown, I don't think. I don't know where where they'd be if they well, if there was one in the hangar. Daniel Jones, Denzel Mims, Melvin Gordon, Jeff Akuda, Bo Jackson, Cam Akers, Eric Metcalf, Randall Cobb, that was going to the Packers, Christian McCaffrey, Tyler Higby, Elijah Moore, Marquez Stevenson, Shane Pichelli, Pete Warner, Patrick Sertain. Jets, Zach Wilson, there you go. Uh, Penny Sewell, Diamond Brown, My House, Trey Lance, and Jacob Harris, okay. Alright, so there's Zach Wilson. Now we need Trevor Lawrence and Mac Jones, so unless this next hanger has one of each. I'm not calling it a successful, well, it, 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 at this break actually it's not too bad. We got just about every single QB, um, in the books besides Matt Jones and Trevor Lawrence. I'm trying to think if there's any other ones that we're missing. We even got Ian Book, Kyle Trask. I think we got every other one. I 
Oh, even this Shane B. Shelley. Well, he's just a base. All right, last hanger, last hanger, last part of the break. Let's have a good one. Save the best for last. All right, Josh Allen, Derek Barnett, Patrick Mahomes, Aaron Jones, Joey Boza, George Kittle, TJ Watts, T.Y. Hilton, James Winston, um, Derek Henry, Shia Smith, Jalen Waddle. Alex Leatherwood. I think I saw who this is. Quiddy Pay. What team? What team? Carolina. Tommy Tremble. Eagles. Kenneth Ganwell. Lions. Jamar Jefferson. Trevor Lawrence. At least we got it, Trevor. Um, Najee Harris. Legendary Logos. Kyle Pitts. Outfits. Alrighty, that is a break. Uh, thank you all for participating um, and seeing what chances you had. Um, I appreciate the support. At least we got a Trevor here. Unfortunately, zero Mac Jones, shockingly. Um, but that's just the way it is sometimes. Um, but overall, I think that this break was actually very fair and equal. Um, even the Patriots, even though you didn't get a Mac Jones, I think that there was still a few Patriots parallel rookies. So at least you're walking away with something. Um, but overall, I think that this break was pretty fair, pretty even. So thank you all once again. Um, hopefully you got some decent cards. Uh, too bad no downtowns. What was the best hit? Um, these ones right here would probably be the best ones, I'd say. Zach Wilson, uh, Blue Scope, Justin Field Silver, Trey Lance Silver, Prism. But um, thank you all once again. Uh, this video will stay up on my Facebook. I click never delete, so it will never delete. And then it will be uploaded to my YouTube so thank you all once again, and I hope to see you in the next one. Have a good weekend.